Good evening, lords and ladies, and gentlemen, and boys and girls, and all those malarkeys and in betweens. I am off shuffle. This is more of the fantastic games we've got called Total War Warhammer. So, we've got our main army here. It's our big army. He's literally just chilling here for a little bit. Um, I'm trying to bring him over there. But obviously, I don't think I can do anything right now. Um, Ungrim for Okay. So you're fine for now. You're my guy. You're one of my guys. My main guy, man. Is that Ogrim? It is. He's level 7 now, result. So why don't we bring him up as... Ogrim will stop at nothing to meet his death in battle. Perfect. Um, let's go for... Small, that's good. Um, ideally, I want him to be... Quite hard to hit. I can imagine hard to hit would be good. So I'm going to go for that. Um, he's getting an army together slowly. Mostly seems to be ranged at the moment though. What's our... Mm, we ain't got enough money. I got a problem. Although so our outgoing will be very low again. What's... That's going to lose. We're not even going to win that. So... Resolve. It's gone. There was no way we were going to win that. It's a, it's a definite no from me. Uh, yeah, we lost everything. He's coming for us. Oh my god, he's coming for us. Greetings, honourable ally. Uh, what's going on? Of course, we're going to go Crooked Moon. Hell yeah. We will face the Crooked Moon when um, we get to them. Right now, obviously, we're not there. But this is, it's, it's more like, what can we do sort of thing, you know? Um, he's got a lot. We haven't. Ready. A nod. I want him to go join up with him. Can you do that? Can you bring Onward. him? Okay, you're still repairing your units. That's fine. Can I get you to attack him? Uh, Is that a thing you can do? I suppose. My slayer oath prevents me. I suppose I can't do that. So you should go back. You should go back. Beards in belts. Damn it. Okay, there, yes, there is an item that needs repairing, but we're not going to do that just yet. Where? Well, the building that needs repairing. Is it here? Is it you? I can afford your repairs. You are lucky. I cannot afford yours. I will wait until next turn to repair your units. We'll see what we can do. That's not going to end well. He's got a lot more units than me. Well, I resolve it. He killed all of my units. Fantastic. And then I'll send my big guys over to take him out. Bring it on. No, no, no. This is fine. Oh, the ranking system's a lot higher on his side. It's potentially going to be a loss just because of his rank. But we will try. And hopefully, if we can't succeed, then Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt sort of thing. We go until we lose as the dwarfs, and then from the dwarfs we move on to another tribe. Oh, I'll say another tribe, another race is probably the correct word. It's probably race. So we'll try race after. See what we can do. Who knows, we might be able to do very, very good things, very particular things. But who knows? We wait and try, wait and try. The bloody loading screens are redonkulous, as I'm sure you people are aware. But unfortunately, we have to wait. This isn't looking really good for us, is it? I 
Okay. Face him in a certain way. Good, let's get some coverage. Get some good coverage here, yep. Miners. You protect the grudge. You're not all gonna protect the grudge, but it's just a it's a temporary measure. Field of fire is very important. We want to make sure that our all flanks are covered. Which they would be. Every range is firing at will, which I like. Thunderous! We demand Thunderous Lord. bring up the things in between. Thunderous. Fill up the gaps. That's it, that's it, that's it. Let the vengeance begin! Um, Coralus. Coralus can go in there. If I move you Thunderous. gunners just over a little bit. Quarrelers. Yeah, put some Coralus there. For the ancestor gods. These Coralus will have to just go there in between, that's fine. Dwarf warriors! It's fine there, they're fine. Let the vengeance begin! For the High King! Yeah, that works. Where is my king? Where is my king? There Your they are. Warriors. So he's there. You are going to hold the ground for as long as possible, okay? Are you firing at will? Go, 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 go. Nothing can stop us. This is going to end horribly. Dwarf warriors! The clans deny! Quarrelers! I have you come! Fire all of them, fire all of them. Yes, yes. Take him out, come on. Moving. Yeah, I know my lord's under attack. Point. Okay, so they're not focusing on that anymore. Get someone else to run away. Get someone else to run away. Right, don't retreat after them. Don't follow them. Go after them. Come on, come on. Turn to the face against someone else. Don't go against the ones that are running. You could cut them off in all fairness. All focus on him. Bring him down. Bring him down. Where is he? The tide of battle has changed very fast on these people. Come on. Let's play some freaking things there. Attack, attack. Go after them. Come on. The leader is dead. The leader is very well. I was wounded. No, no, he's dead. Come on. 
Can you still hit them? Oh my god, you can hit them quite far. We see if we can properly wipe out some of these guys. It would be good to try and take them out completely. Or if not heavily wound them. Probably not going to be able to do that. How many they got? 63. Uh, 45, 45, 45. 22 orc Their forces have dwindled by a lot. They've abandoned their, their ones. That's fine. We'll end the battle. We won. So a win's a win, isn't it? Just a result. No, we're not saving Greek. So, their main guy killed 60 of my people. Supposedly. I did have two lords in there. That's a lot. Execute the captives. Do not let them survive. Um, what just... What? What's, what's that gnome... Uh, not gnome. What's that goblin doing? Um, yep, cool. The denizens are dangerously agitated, my lord. Soon they will take up arms against you. Move swiftly to crush or appease them. An army got me big boss, but I'm going to just have to hinder Douglas army. That's good. So, look, he hasn't, but okay. For the wisdom of the it is literally just a process of going and attacking him now. We could attack him and wipe him out, potentially. Um, what's that? If I get that, when when do I... Un oh, I have to get all four. Right, I get all four to unlock that. And I can move up there. Perfect. Okay, we'll do that with you. What is? I'll just see what this thing can do. One rug. Um... Yes, my oath is intact. No, I didn't want to do encampment, you silly sausage. Um, minimum is there. Let's just go in better there. What to attack? I want to do like some form of raid. I'll the slayer throng moves. Aye, I'll move. Go in there, you silly sausage. Come on, get back in there. Get your ass back in there. Right. So. But this one over here, it's damaged a little bit. We need the fort back. Um, that needs to be upgraded, but we can't do that this turn. Yes. This guy's here, but also there was that second boss. Um, you seem pretty damn cool, actually. Like you've got a lot, so attack him. Just to wipe him out a little bit more. Be about this. Time to slip. The enemy bring reinforcements to the fight. Will an attack be wise? Yes. Yes. He may bring reinforcements. But I still have quite a lot of heavy artillery. So, what are we going to do? Is I'm going to do pretty much exactly the same thing. I'm going to line up the cannons, line up the quarrelers, line up the thunderers. Um, get my... what. Some of my worries just to sit with them, just to sit, and then eventually run towards the enemy. Um, pretty sure the map's small enough. Oh, we've got high ground. However, they've got high ground. They've got reinforcements waiting at the back. Should take extra long to come to us. We've just got our army as it stands here. This is a shocking battlefield. This isn't a good one. Um, oh, that's BS, isn't it? Okay, so. It is a Cross throwers there. Your range ain't bad on that bit. 
Uh, where's the other grudge throw? There it is. What I'll have to do is just bring up the cannons. The cannons will have to march forward a little bit. I'll put them in a place where they will be handy. Well, to be honest, they might actually be able to hit. They might. They have wronged us indeed, my friend. That's why we're going to go wipe them out. But these, all got, these guys are all together. Yes. Just to make sure that they are safe. Barracks ready. Quarrelets. Um, For the ancestors. I'll take you over there. Quarrelers. You over there. And then take you. We will have vengeance. Over here. Hey, they Enemy might be approaching. reinforcements are approaching. Attack with caution, Commander. Oh, we can do a number on them already. Them, in fact, them cannons. Got pretty much a direct shot on them. Can you focus on them? They got two left. Bring them down, down. For the double time, get over there, double time. Let you move up double time. You two move up there quickly. Go quick. Take him out. Then you got one left. Come on. Cannons are high. Why has it gone to ten? Oh, they want to soldiers because they're running. Fire at them, fire at them. Well, I'll let the Drudge Lords take the Drudge Throwers, whatever they're bloody called, take out the reinforcements as they come up. In fact, if you guys go and meet them, I'll let you meet. Oh, no, no, you can meet them. Hold on, you can meet them. Hold on, you can meet them. Hold on, come on. Straight into our forces. Thunderous. Turn the face, come on. For the Karas Ancor, Clouds Road. Take out their army. We'll be fine. That guy's nearly dead, so yes. I go take out that little bit of Their reinforcements. Their reinforcements aren't even showing up yet. I know they're coming, but where? Take them out, take them out. Here come the reinforcements. Can we start taking out them guys? Move up, move up, move up. Let the vengeance begin. Move over there quickly. So right, these corridors won't, won't let them come out. If I get him to come over here, they're gonna set up a perimeter. Get you guys to move up slowly. Reinforcements now. Take out the reinforcements. We need to take out the reinforcements. Right. And now he's coming back. You go 
let's focus. This is where the dwarfs prevail in such good ways. Look at them. Their guns. The big orc is running already. Run this look. There's nothing you can do. You will die. Today you will die. It's not going to be a wounding. It's going to be a death. I'm going to make sure of that. Guys, go join the main fight. Oh, it's a victory. <laughs> is he dead, though? Is he dead, or is he just wounded? Yeah, I actually want him dead, dead. I reckon my cannon's going to hit him. At the end of the day, if he's wiping out... If his soldiers are getting wiped out more, as in his little army that follows him, or blindly follows him, stupidly follows him, um, then they will die along with him. At the end of the day, uh, it's going to be dark for the El uh, for the orcs. He's got a long way to go, but that is the end of the battlefield. He's got a long stretch to run. And he's actually really dead. Come on. Double time. Oh, hit one of ours then. What I really want is one of the grudge throws to knock him back. I probably noticed that half my army potentially dies as a result of um, my friendly fire. But, it's all in the name of wiping out all the orcs. He's going to make it to the end. Where's the end? This is the end. It's quite dramatic the way they run. He's basically being hacked at his ankles. He's going to make it to the end. Like, he literally will make it to the end. I'm saying that, he is running a slightly longer way now. For the high king! For the Hold high fire. King! We hold? Move it out! The enemy lord is dead. Good. End battle. That's what we do. We end the battle of death. So he's dead dead now, which is good. I love the fact he's dead dead. He only killed five of my guns. Wow, I deployed 920 and lost next to none. They deployed 1,030. I lost a lot more. Yeah, we could. I was going to them out. more. I like that, we gained um, some stuff. Good, one of their lords is now dead. Even though he's still bloody right here. I still have quite For a large army. Of I'm going to head back. Do you take me for oh. a I yes. don't take you for a wazzock. No, I will not shame my clan. Can you can you move? That's fine. So now I can then do rallies the next one, which I like. Um, is there I will not I can disgrace go my ancestors. Okay, well. um, I've got a lot of gold. Twenty out of twenty is my gold cap right now. I grow you restless. Can get back in there. No, Moving. you cannot. 
I'm actually going to end it here on today's episode. We're going to get this guy back in here. I want to give him a full army. A full army, should I say. Um, and then at least I can come around here and really work on the cities around here. And hopefully claim this area as Dwarven. Because that would be rather nice, wouldn't it? Like, we have this area. This is all green. But do you see a Dwarven encampment here? But I bloody don't. We're gonna make some down there. We're gonna push out the orcs in this corner, um, and hopefully that will bring us favors and justice in the world, and we can rebuild all of the all the areas that are broken around here. I could, uh, ooh, I could, I could. I need one population surplus, which I don't have. <gasps> oh, no. Blood River Valley. There's two that I don't own, whereas in Silver Road. I own everything. Can I upgrade that? No, only 4,800. Can't upgrade that, which will give me runesmiths. Can't upgrade that. Can't upgrade that. Can't upgrade that. And I can't. Oh, can I? I can't upgrade that because of the cost. That's BS. I'll leave it here for now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. I've been more shuffled. Till next time, take it easy. Enjoy big scary monsters and uh, let's wipe out the orcs and make all that map green. Bye for now.